Hey there, if you're an executive or professional at a small or medium-sized business, this message is for you. You might be wondering, why should I care about sustainability? Well, picture this, a world where resources are finite and every decision we make today can shape our tomorrow. Sounds familiar? It's just like the story of the Lorax by Dr. Seuss. In the Lorax, a tale unfolds about a beautiful forest, thriving until the greedy once lair chops down all the trafula trees to make the needs. Eventually the land becomes barren and the once lair is left regretting his choices. Now imagine your business is the forest. Sustainable practices are the trafula trees. Sustainability isn't just about being green or ticking a box. It's about ensuring the longevity and health of your business in all dimensions. Think about it, investing in energy efficiency, clean energy technologies, eliminating waste and making more sustainable choices can drastically cut costs. Plus, it boosts your brand's reputation. Customers today are more informed and conscious about their buying choices. They prefer companies that align with their values and sustainability ranks high on their list. By embracing sustainable practices, you attract these discerning customers and build loyalty. Let's talk about innovation. When you commit to sustainability, you open doors to new opportunities and markets. You encourage your team to think creatively, to find innovative solutions that are both profitable and more sustainable. This can set you apart from competitors and place you as a leader in your industry. Now you might be thinking, but it sounds expensive. Sure, the initial investment might seem daunting, but let me tell you, the return on investment is significant. Take a look at companies that have adopted sustainable practices. They report higher efficiency, lower operational costs, and increased profitability. And it doesn't stop there. Employees want to work for companies they believe in, those with similar values to their own. Adopting sustainable practices can attract top talent. People want to be part of something meaningful, something impactful. In the story of the Lorax, there's a pivotal moment when the Wanzler realizes the error of his ways. He hands the last truffle of seed to a young boy, hoping he can rejuvenate the forest. The lesson here? It's never too late to change. As an executive, you have the power to plant that seed of sustainability within your business. Nurture it and watch it grow into uh, a thriving, resilient enterprise that can withstand challenges and uncertainty. So take that first step. Embrace sustainability and the circular economy, not just for the environment, but for the future of your business. Remember, what you do today shapes your tomorrow. Be the Lorax of your business world. Speak for the trees. Thanks for tuning in. Let's make a difference together. If you haven't read the Lorax, there's a link in the description of this video. I recommend it. Until next time, take care.